Hey. 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 How y'all doing tonight? I don't know. I don't know what's been happening for the last two hours. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. It's got all weird. All right. It's a weird time, weird places. This is Friday night where we talk about weird stuff, ancient knowledge, anti Rockefeller uh, uh, realities. <laughs> Anyway, I don't have anything to talk about. What are you going to talk about? Yeah. Anti Rockefeller, you trying to get us banned? This is our first day back, isn't it? <laughs> I'm, it I'm is. reformed. Let's see how many I'm minutes reformed. we can go on Facebook yeah. without getting banned. Let's yeah. talk about the people's passport. How nobody can travel. Let's talk about that. <laughs> hey, 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 take your vaccines. Listen to Bill Gates. Okay? Fauci loves you and grandma. Biden's not, not a no reptilian. <laughs> God is not reptilian. Reptilians known as the Bigfoot's name is not Durrell. Aliens don't exist. The United States does not have secret technologies. They don't have any weather engineering anything. Climate change is real, people. We need to fight and stop climate change by ending fossil fuels. Um, what else? Russia is the bad guy. Hate Russia. Don't like Russia at all. China don't like no China. Right. No, no, we no, like China we now, don't China. we? We love China now. You're China. We need to be China. We need a red flag from now on out. It's and, like Orwell. Before, you know? Orwell. Mm -hmm. We have always been at war with Eurasia, and we have always been allied with East Asia. And then next week, it reverses. It changes. Yes. With uh, Venezuela. Indifference to reason. Yes. Venezuela and Bolivia, you need to give us your oil mm -hmm. and your lithium. It's for the greater good. We love mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. no, the government just are, need us to bring democracy. And you need freedom. democracy. You got terrorism. <laughs> terrorism's everywhere. You got terrorists. We don't want running their around oil. the country in the bushes, huh? We don't want their oil. We just want. No, to we don't need freedom. your oil. That's right. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Did I say that? I didn't mean that. I didn't mean. We're gonna let y'all keep your oil. <laughs> we love you. Damn it. We need to give you some democracies and some freedoms. Yeah. All right. You know, let us bring the bombers to to bring you some love and gentle, kind tenderness. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> um. Mexico, y'all need to stay where you at. Stop running over that border. Cut that out. Wait a minute. No, do we Let like me the love border? you like the government. I'm right. The government loves you, people. Damn it. They love you. Love them back. They're not hiding ancient technology, books, nope. and mysterious things. Black people be black. White people be white. Get out there and fight. All right? Just no, don't white fight people. with the corporations. White people need we to feel guilty. Some, yeah, we have guilty. <laughs> We have to put See, all right, guarantee. stop, stop it, stop it. We're gonna go right back to Facebook jail. Let's talk about ancient consciousness and, and spirituality and some moons and stars. Quay, whose house is in the house, the house? We need to go back to that because y'all gonna get me in trouble. <laughs> get me in the principal's office. I'm tired of being in the principal's office. I'm gonna start telling on people. Mark Zuckerberg, they talk about your mama. I'm gonna start telling on you. That's what I'm. Yeah, he's not a reptilian either. No, he's not. A, no, he's not. No. He's, he's a good man. He's an android. He's a good <laughs> husband <laughs> and father. And damn it, he's a swell American. Mm -hmm. We love Mark Zuckerberg. Yep. And his skin damn has it. that plastic glow. <laughs> oh, yes. We need to switch to some chemical soaps and, <laughs> and the chemical lotions. There's nothing stronger than plastic skin. skin. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Eat your GMOs. <laughs> you gotta eat them G get them GMOs. It'll give you that plasticity. Yes. You know? That healthiness. Glyphosate it's free is good anti -aging. for you. Free anti-aging. Free anti-aging. Yeah, anti anti-aging. <laughs> exactly. It's like good for the yin and the yang. It'll make a yin with the yang. And you do fertility. Yeah. All of that. Mm -hmm. All of that. Good for the cheetah. Damn it. Yep. I'm reformed. Yep. I ain't going back to Facebook jail. I'm done. I give up. I think y'all should just go do everything that the billionaires tell you to do. Anyway, mm -hmm. how y'all doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, Everybody you good? know what? We are good. Gerard, when you were disappeared for a while, <laughs> we I were was talking disappeared. about. <laughs> yeah, we were, <laughs> you were disappeared. We were talking about how money, right, isn't even real. 
and and we all pretty much know. Okay, we're getting kicked off, and we all pretty much know. Should we money like, is real. Broke. We're and, talking and about just say whatever the hell we want today. <laughs> we know we're money, get banned. Money is real and important. You need money yeah. to live and exist in life. And the more money you make, the more angels in heavens get some wings and crowns and stuff. <laughs> angels love money. You suppose Christ loved money? He didn't turn over no tables. You, no, you, money's good, girl. Money ain't fake. Get that so, money. Get money. So it's not even real, right? And it only exists. That's another thing. It only exists because we believe in it. So imagine if we believed that much in like free energy and a peaceful society. Imagine if we spent that much energy believing in those things instead of yeah. this fake construct they've you are such a conspiracy into. theorist. No, I don't know. <laughs> they're not like, no, don't believe in no damn free. It ain't no free energy. Energy ain't free. Everything has a cause. You make a stuff or you conspiracy yeah, theorist. Q Donald Trump person. <laughs> Cut it out. <laughs> damn it. No, ain't no free energy. You need to pay for the energy. Yeah. Make that money. Pay for that energy. That's how that works. We ain't doing conspiracy theories no more. But how crazy is this, right? Because a lot of our survival is dependent upon money, right? And it's not even real. Isn't that crazy? I'm giving you the evil eye. Are you, are you seeing that? I, I'm, I'm giving it to you. Are you feeling it? Damn it. You're going to get me thrown in jail again. I told you I'm done with that. Two hots and a cot. No. <laughs> Whose yeah. house is in somebody's Not on room. my account. I'll say what I want. <laughs> <laughs> I know I've done that. I get people put in Facebook jail a lot. That's why I try not to say nothing no more. All right. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree I'm with you. Saying. We can we can make anything reality. You you this Susan, this your world, girl squirrel. This you know this is your world, squirrel. We just trying to get some nuts here. You running <laughs> the show. You know this is not the Truman Show. It's the Susan Show. You manifest your reality. Bofunt snoozing right there. He, he manifests his reality, Christine, her reality, Jonathan, you, this is your world. You got to go live your world life. Don't let no money in these people, Mark Zuckerberg, social media, oil, gravity. Don't let these things control you. You manifest you. That's ancient knowledge. Mm -hmm. You worry about what people thinking, saying. Don't let Courtney tell you what. Nobody get on damn what Courtney want to do. Courtney need to do Courtney, right? That's where we need to be. That's ancient knowledge. But as we were evolving, going through the dark ages and all the rough times with the chainsaws and the, you know, the things in the metal and put you in the tire, London, all that stuff, we lived our lives. We did what we had to do. We was chihuahuas, y'all. We didn't sit there and work. Oh, the government, what do I supposed to do? No, <laughs> damn it, somebody come in. You got to be chihuahuas. You got to get them ankles, man. Live your life, manifest your reality. If you want to be the big dog, you could be two pounds, be the big dog, and the dog eats you and you come out as extra man, but that's okay. You still got to live your life. Mm -hmm. And if you're new, that's why I don't do drugs. That's exactly because Susan said something and that ended up in an 80 hour rant. <laughs> 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 Dry, you need to do some cannabis and some shrooms with us. No, I don't. I'm already high on life. I need to learn how to shut the hell up now. Oh, Lord. Ancient yep. knowledge. What are we going to yep. talk about, y'all? What's ancient knowledge? Here's some ancient knowledge. Bofa is already having trouble. Yeah, <laughs> oh, Bofa, come on. <laughs> Who's he blocking? Somebody block. You know what? Y'all remember when he was new? Bofa, Everybody blocked him. I never blocked Bofont. You didn't block him? No, and I used then to go on live streams in his little chats and talk to him. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I know, but if you pissed him off, he blocked All you. You, so you didn't have to block him. I never did. He, he didn't block you? <laughs> nope. nope. Well, he must be sweet on you. I knew he was smart. <laughs> huh? oh, he I mean, I always you. disagree or understand, but he was smart. I knew I could learn from him. Susan, I used to have like seances with candles, get together with the people and friends and stuff like, Bofon blocked me. He blocked everybody on my friends list. And like, who are you talking to, Gerard? You talking to yourself, damn it, what's wrong with you? I'm like, no, I'm talking to Bofon. So I can't see his comments because he blocked me. I used to have all of these things with people because he blocked everybody. But he don't block yeah, nobody. He I think he blocked people now. Yeah, I don't know. I do, yeah, he, I don't know. You got, that, you got that magical power. 
Mm-hmm. I'm not going to tell you what the power is because that's going to have me in Facebook jail again. <laughs> yeah, let's move on. <laughs> Women have magical pies. And <laughs> pie. That's what it is. Free tamales. What do I have to do? Taco. Stop reading. No, that's tacos is snorting. So, no. <laughs> Molly's with <what's> that. <laughs> Explain. Mm-hmm. How did we go to sniffing people? Hide in a way. No more, Biden <laughs> talk. no more political Biden talk around here. <laughs> Wait, are you talking about my president? Are you talking about my president? You better not be talking about my president. Hell no, I ain't tolerating that. Me and Mark Zuckerberg, we don't tolerate that. You respect your president, <laughs> damn it. Name ain't, was he 47, 8, 46, 40? No, he was 45, so 46. Don't call him no 46. You give him his honorable name, Sniffy Bowden. <laughs> no, Ivan Bowden. All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Okay. All right. All right. So sh- what are we talking about? Are we doing ancient knowledge or are we yeah, just yeah. like making jokes? Yeah, we are. We are. Yeah. Uh, we thought. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> there you go. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, you're going to read. I was just going to say, Jonathan's going to read the chapter out read, of the new about chapter, astrology. We're going to go back yeah. to initiation, Elizabeth H. Yeah. And I'm going to read chapter 34, which is called The Four Faces of God, which in, integrates uh, some sacred geometry, some astrology and meditative practices so it's it's a little bit of practical yeah that's five hours to look. <laughs> <laughs> we're, go- we're gonna go right into it today yeah yeah okay. all right yeah. Anyway, here we go okay are we ready not really but no? let's 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 yeah, get into and, the- and if the interjections sorry Gerard, if the interjections carry it out too long because we have to keep in mind that it's getting very late yes for- Christine. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. We need a whistle. Yeah. Gerard hasn't been doing the weeklies. I told you guys we can get together a better. Yeah. <laughs> we can do we yes. Yeah, because I'm not doing the weekly. I'm not the dailies. I'm not doing those no more. Yeah. We can do this anytime y'all want. Okay. I'm not I'm not fighting government. Not no yeah. love them. I love them. They love my grandmama. Even though she <laughs> did in the grave, all of them. They still yeah. love them and they want to save them. So yeah. Uh, I'm not doing the day. So, yeah, we can do this any day you want. Yeah, we can leave it up to Christine because she's way ahead of yeah. us on the timelines. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. 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 Okay. Just as long as it's after yeah. slavery. Definitely. Yeah, okay. Yeah. If I fall asleep. No, yeah. <laughs> you're okay. I'm going to be a good black good. man. Yeah. I'm going to do. I'm gonna be gardening black man. That's what I'm going to do. We're going to just garden black man videos. That's all I'm doing. That's all we're going to do. All right. That's Here racist. Yep. All right. Yep. Now, do we need a whistle? How are we going to stop Jonathan? This is uh, ancient wisdom, the racist version. Okay. All right, so we're gonna like raise our hand. How do we like stop? Throw a pen at me. Um, a cyber I, pen. Yo! Yeah. Scream! Shout! Hey! Stop! Yeah. Hey! Fall back! We're in the matrix. We have to use sounds. <laughs> oh All right. All right. Okay. Because they understand okay. sound vibrations no. and energy better than us do, and they're sucking it out of us right now. All right, go ahead. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting bad. Matrix is getting glitchy. All right. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Here we go. The four faces of God. Again, I said before Tahotep. My child, he begins. Today, you'll learn what the four faces of God are. It will help you very, very much to recognize them in you. The four faces of God are in everything that has been created. All of creation, including yourself, has been built up on his four faces. Life in the visible world, beginning with the gigantic central suns of the world systems and running all the way down to the tiniest protozoa, is merely a rotation around the four faces and in the four faces of God. You know why we always represent divinity in its primordial state of resting within itself as an equilateral triangle. An equilateral triangle is a perfect triangle, a triangle of equal equal angles and equal lengths on each of the sides. So there's a there's, there's an equilateral triangle right there, the top one. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Go ahead. 
God in his three aspects is one in three and three in one. But this condition, just like the equilateral triangle, carries within itself the possibility of the number four. When the three aspects of the basic number one separate from each other, and this happens when they move from the unmanifested into the manifested state, the one in three becomes one and three. In this way, the number four is born. Cast a glance at the equilateral triangle. In it, if you see, uh, in it, you see only one unit, which has three sides, three aspects. But it contains, hidden and unmanifested, the number four. Because the equilateral triangle can be divided up into four smaller equilateral triangles. Here is the second image of that. So you can see four triangles, four individual triangles within the one triangle. Three within one. Make it actually four within one. Yeah, go ahead. Ask a stupid question real quick. There are no stupid questions, Gerard. Yes, there are when it comes to your mind. <laughs> <laughs> she had to set it up. Nah, I know him. Hell no. You didn't even say no stupid question to him. Nah, because if it's stupid, I got to call it stupid. Um, <laughs> sorry. I so, um, <laughs> um, I'm sorry. No, no. no. So, I'm I'm, first of all, all right. I need yeah. I need to know what we're reading. Okay. And because three gods, I was raised in the church in the church. Um, yeah. There was only three gods: <laughs> Trinity, one, yes. two, three. Yeah. And now we're doing some trigonometry and some pyramids, and the three gods is the four gods and the manifest and non-manifest. Well, what are we reading? Okay. And are we really are we saying that there is a fourth god that we don't we, no, no. we don't know his name or her name yet? No, it's I think it's like this: the fourth god is the one. The thing God is not manifested, but part of God is manifested in the three in the Trinity. That's what I understand about it. But God itself is not manifested. Is that right, Jonathan? What do you uh, say? Say that again. Say that again. So the so the manifestation is in a tree and. In three, like, um, but the fourth aspect is the unmanifested one, and where and when we go in rest, we are in un, un, uh, We are, um, I mean, if we, if we go in the true meditation, I think we are in the unite with the unmanifested one. I mean, that's what I get out of it, but it's kind of a not easy topic. That's no. what I get out of it. But what do you think? I, I think um, if we read further on, she'll probably explain this. Okay. But the the um, the law of three, three being a magical number, three being the number mm -hmm. of completion, beginning, mm -hmm. middle, and father, mother, and child. Uh, those yeah. that that yeah. law, that spiritual law, is everyone. Yeah. Now there's also a law of seven, or the law of octaves as Gurdjieff puts it. And that is also very important. Um, it's, if you're familiar with the notes on, on the octaves, the musical scale, you know, C, D, E, F, G, A, B. And Fa, uh, uh, no, it doesn't begin with Fa. Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Fa Sol, so, La, La, do. Di, and back to Do. I was in prior. Yeah. So was I, I was in the church, and then, in the yeah. church. And then, wow. and then um, back to um, back to Doe again. The law of octaves is also has a lot to do with entropy and the loss of energy. And the there is a crisis, according to Gurdjieff, there is a crisis after between three and four. Between the third note and the fourth note, there's a loss of energy. And so the, 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 the direction alters unless we add energy, effort from the outside. In the I Ching, the movement between three up to four is also the movement from earth to heaven. 
because three and four, the two middle lines of each hexagram, represents man. Th those are the two lines indicating human race, human <laughs> beings. One, one line is on earth, the other line is in heaven. So we are at a crossroads. We are at a crossroads. We are a combination of heaven and earth. We have our feet on the earth and we are capable of reaching mm -hmm. to the sky, to the heavens. So the, the law of the three and four together make up seven. I'm just throwing that out there for anyone to, you know, think about, meditate on. But let's um let's see what um, else she says here. Yeah, go ahead. Well, I just wanted to say real quick too, it for some reason I thought of it as so one and three equals four, right? Yeah. And so the one is us in the material world, right? Because we can only interact with four dimensions. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I, and you. and in my mind, right? Because the um, Odin symbol of death and rebirth is three triangles, right? Mm -hmm. So like a process going over again and again. Right. And and I think that's once you master those, then you transcend to the fifth. <laughs> Does that make sense? Yeah. No. Okay. No. I don't know what y'all talking about. I'm going to be honest with you. And it's probably because I'm used to being alone. Said this shit is so it is. I agree with Courtney. <laughs> now, like Courtney. I don't know what the hell they talking about. You're right. You, it's all right because I have no idea. These people talking about three, four gods and dimensions. <laughs> and they, 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 Odin is now in it. on it. And Odin ain't from Africa, is he? Is he? Is he, Courtney? So yeah, this is racist. I think it is. I think you're right on that. I got nothing else. I don't know that. I thought I thought Courtney for a minute. I thought Susan was gonna go along with me and just be be the blonde that I am. And I don't know what the hell y'all talking about. And Courtney was like, no, no. Susan's like, oh yeah, I understand. And in my version of it, because what I'm thinking about the Norse gods, I don't know what the hell they're talking about, Courtney. I don't know what the hell they. I think that these people smoking something. <laughs> and, it, and maybe it's because I'm because Shatita asked me what I'm eating. Beaufont said I'm eating, I'm not eating smooth, and that's probably because I'm not eating a smoothie. Mm -hmm. I'm eating GMOs. My third eye and fourth, they probably all closed up right now. <laughs> <They're all closed laughs> <up. laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm tripping out. I, I'm I'm following. I'm not there, but I'm following. Don't let me ruin it. Okay. Just keep keep with the races going. Just get it. Hey, Arsh. All right, we're, where what were we talking about? <laughs> what were we Just talking clan, about? Uh, <laughs> yeah, this. All right, all right. Okay. Oh wait, one more thing. <laughs> Courtney said three plus four equals twelve. <laughs> three times four. I'm eating my steak sandwich. And we're in the twelfth dimension, and then we get to be gods. <laughs> <laughs> now we gods now. <laughs> I can't even um, get out of Facebook jail. I'm a god. Then what can I do with my superpowers? I don't know. You got to develop Zuckerberg. them. That ain't up to me. <laughs> can I make a toe grow out of his nose or something? That would um, be nice. The, the, the mm -hmm. triangle picture, right? Yeah. yeah. With the other triangles in it. Mm -hmm. Right. So if you keep doing that, you're going to get a, I'm not going to say it right, to tech to hedron. Uh, yes, 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 exactly. Yeah. A yeah. Right. Uh -huh. And right. if you have a um, like some guy made a tetrahedron yeah, out of um, glass, and when you shine a light on it, the shadow it casts it makes the flower of life. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, if you have it developed, yeah. yeah. Oh, I've done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I know that one. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. the flower of life. So it's yeah. all this like fractal pattern stuff, and and like the serpent knowledge, right? Wait, I gonna take a picture of the flower of life. Wait. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Is it racist? And, oh. and like <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this ain't gonna last. Y'all know we're going right back to jail. You know this ain't gonna last. Yes. See, if you put a triangular tetrahedron, which is just a bunch of triangles, right? That makes like this starry mm -hmm. shape. Mm -hmm. And and you cast a sh like a shine a light on it, it makes mm -hmm. the flower of life pattern. Yes, that's the shadow that will come up. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So I don't know <laughs> what that really means. But if that is the shape that they think is the universe, 
and and light reflects on it to make this flower of life pattern. Mm -hmm. And we talk about the serpent knowledge, which I'm starting to think it's just understanding the energy waves because that's what they look like. They look like serpents. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So got to get out of this matrix. The DNA is also yes, yes, yes. It's, like it's all connected. That's also medicine stuff. Theseus takes yeah around the galaxy it moves in, uh, the, the entire solar system rotates right viral and it moves always everything <laughs> is like that yeah yes and and that like, is, that's and it's a continuous um i think growing and um renewing itself i think yes and <clears throat> remember i was saying how like so you have the galactic center right right which is like um, not really a straight line, but you know, so you have the galactic center and then you have the solar system going like this, weaving out and in for the, um, which right. makes a serpent shape, right. um, which make that 20, it takes the 26,000 year procession cycle to do that, mm -hmm. to go up and down. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's all connected. It's all sine waves. It's all energy and frequency and right. yeah. yeah, we can figure this out. I have faith. I have faith if we work together, we can do this. <laughs> I do. Right. Um, you know, th th there's basically really three numbers. All, all, all other numbers really boil down to one, two, or three in, in terms of oh, the technology. Yeah. You know, um, Lao Tzu three, says, six, nine. Yeah. Lao Tzu says in, in the Tao Te Ching, uh, one begets two, two begets three, three begets the 10,000 things. So from three, from three numbers, we, it, which is kind of com against common sense because we think, you know, uh, it takes two to tango, right? And then from two, you get procreation and, you know, birth. But in numerology, it's actually three because all four is really just a version of one. Five is, is a version of two. Six is a version of three and so on. And, and, and it becomes more complex. And then, of course, after you get past nine, you get to 10, 10 reduces to one, 11 reduces to two and so on. So um, that's, I, I think that's, I think there's something there. There's, there's, there's a, uh, a mystery there, you know, mm -hmm. in, in numbers, something yeah, that's a whole yeah. lot of mystery there. All right. It, it is a mystery. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but, uh, Rockefeller did not teach that in mathematics. <laughs> Lao Tzu needs to go to the math class I went to because they didn't go to three. And stop. It went four, and we had five, and we had six. So yeah. it's a mystery. Yeah. yeah. There's, you know, there's wisdom in, in numerology, and, and yeah. you know, um, she's talking about geometry, and it, geometry. You go back to Plato. You go back to Pythagoras. You go back to all those ancient, those ancient mystery schools where they, and then it goes back to Egypt, and then that goes back to Atlantis. Even the ancient sites. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's all geometry. All geometry. All geometry. Yeah. All geometry, and, but also geometry related to the earth and the astrological alignments. Yeah. Like. Well, mathematics is the language of the universe. Yes. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. But I don't understand it. <laughs> but I don't understand it either. <laughs> I don't care. No, I don't know. I, I just want to say something smart. I know it connects. I see it in my head, but I can't explain it to you. <laughs> but, but it's true. That's all that matters. It sounds smart, damn it. Mathematics is the language of the universe. It sounds deep. Oh, yeah. Math is racist now. I don't think we can talk about it. <laughs> oh, no, I can say it. I can say it. You can't say it. I can say it. Cause oh, yeah. That's right. Because I got white privilege. I can't say That's it. That's right. And I, I can drink Pepsi and Coke, but you can't. I think you can only drink Pepsi now. Because you're drinking Coke. Is it Coke? No, is no. Coke. I can drink Coke because Coke makes you less white. Okay. So you drink Coke. It's darkening you up. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah, you could lay out in the sun or just drink more Coke. Uh, we uh, we going to be in jail. I hope y'all enjoying this broadcast. We yeah, because we're going to jail. Right? <laughs> Why y'all keep talking about oh, I'm sorry. Are we not GMO right now? I'm, I'm, I'm getting ready. I got an appointment to get my injection, y'all. Trying to stay out of jail. Um, Racism is bad. We need to fight it. Damn it, don't drink that wrong soda pop that'll make you racist. Oh, Lord. Um, I haven't been yeah. paying attention though. I don't know the details on that. I just think the memes are funny. Mm. 
Oh, no, no. The polar bear? Because he was too white, right? Yeah. He was, in, yeah. he was too white and they had to get rid of him. And uh, did they, they, are they going to make the snow black too? Or are they going to put him on with, the uh, What, giving their employees, you know, uh, how, to, how to be less white training? Basically. Yeah, I, mean, right. yeah, I, I mean, that was it. That was it. They were serious. They were serious. Yeah. So. <laughs> how do you know he's a racist too now? I know. I know. The problem is, Y'all don't know how to y'all don't know how to deal with it. Then it's racist. Hey, I'm good well, black right now, black. If, it, if, it, if it was us, we'd be marching. We just an old Negro. I actually had something So it started in the universities and it started about 25, 30 years ago. I need to march. Yeah. It goes back. I go with you. Jordan Peterson does that. Does yeah. that great. Yeah. I love Jordan Peterson. Yeah. See, he, we don't so logical. That. Yeah. We find mm -hmm. some lunch counters or something. We get out there and get the going. Y'all need to march. Right. We haven't seen this before. <laughs> That's racist. Start marching for what? To be white? I don't give yes. a shit what color you think I am. <laughs> we shall overcome. <laughs> like you got to get some songs together and get out there and yeah. get the march. Because they're going to get away with Y'all don't stop them. Y'all y'all too quiet. Should I, 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 know what, should I dye my beard? It's too white. Hmm? What color should I dye my beard? It's obviously too white. Obvious. I need to, I need to unwhite the beard. Obviously. I just don't have time for this nonsense, yo. I know some of y'all believe this stuff. But this oh, is I'm going like, to be this. a new superhero, super white. <laughs> Thanks, Christine. <laughs> Write a comic book. Oh, God. Super white. All right, but seriously, right. seriously, right. so right. we, we, we <laughs> joke directly. I'm, I got to say my my thirty seconds yeah. worth. I ain't been online in in a month. <laughs> let us let us have it, Gerard. Go for it. I just I just froze him. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't. It's so hard. Like, how do you take people back to like principles? And this is not that it's not on topic, right? In terms of ancient knowledge and working together and being a part of a whole, not all these little subdivisions of ignorant people fighting each other over things that and resources that the other people don't even have, right? It's abuse, Banker, banker's right? Games. It's, it's abuse. Here's banker's my stance, mm -hmm. right? My stance is this, is number one, I ain't no victim. That's number one. Yep. Anybody who thinks I'm a victim can kiss my ashy brown booty. All right, I'm not a victim. And my skin is not a sin, nor is my skin a an impairment. And what gets me, what buggles my biscuits and burns my toast <laughs> is the idea that, yeah, I'm from the South, I can make that stuff. Is people think that it's a handicap. And these little young yeah, liberals running around here thinking that, oh, Mr. Black man, we got to help you because you, you have <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 you're disabled. They have to watch you all know, the Archie you know, Bunker shows, Archie Bunker shows, you know, Archie Bunker. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah let them watch them. That's the, that's yeah. what we teach them. Oh so my no God. Matter, oh, Today's world no would lose their freaking minds. <laughs> So here's the beautiful thing. A lost man standing. Um, they think Dr. Seuss is offensive. Yeah. Here, but here's the beautiful thing. And I'm and I'm gonna agree with Eric, Eric July. And that is I have a respect yeah. for open racism, right? Real racism. Mm -hmm. I have an open respect for someone who can look me in the eye and say, I don't like you because of this. I can respect that as a man or a woman standing passionate in their own belief systems. What I don't respect is this little hidden racism. And I look at your skin and because you're skin, you're lesser than I am. I'm a white liberal. I'm here to help you. I must lift you out of your own ignorance, right? I have to help you to raise your children, unlike Jive and Bowden said, to play <laughs> out. Don't look at me going. So, so I don't <laughs> respect <laughs> hidden racism. Mm -hmm. I'm fine with racism. Mm -hmm. I'm, if you, if you, you know, if you approach me and you are true, I'm good with you. Yeah. Right? We can work on this, right? If you got these little secret nuances, and, and this is this is where the left gets me, right? These little secret ideologies that you're lesser. 
Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm gonna stop there. I don't. Why are the rules? Yeah, is that not what Biden says? The black always, children can be as smart as white children. Do mm-hmm. you not say that? Yeah. <laughs> you on your toes in the in in the academy. Imagine if Trump <laughs> said that. Yeah, I know. Know that something you say will be interpreted by someone as racist or sexist or or any of the other you know, it will fall in someone's categories. And it's it's a lot like um, the situation that you find yourself in, um, what, someone say something. Yeah. I see, I'm afraid to, I'm afraid to talk it. Uh, with, I think you should I read, to be honest with you. I, I think you should read. I just, yeah. I right. like, uh, like, enough, enough of this. Enough of this. Right. You know what? Just because the thing is, at, at a certain point in time, let people show you who they are. Yeah. Process who they are and yeah. keep going. And then yeah. and the time for talking about this stuff on the internet is over. It, it, yeah. it really is. Right, right now. We can and it's talk a waste of time, things. really. It's a waste of time. Mm-hmm. You know, people are where they are and they're doing what they want to do. We have to stand on principles, talk about principles at that level, talk about ancient knowledge, mm-hmm. and, and let people you know figure out their own way. Sometimes you got to walk in a bear trap to realize you shouldn't jump up and down on a bear trap. Mm-hmm. So I think we should just read. Mm-hmm. That's what I kind of okay. ancient knowledge. I, mean, more, I wanted to say talking. something, but now I forget. You can't. You're not allowed. You look like a <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it wasn't about racism. Oh, I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Because I, I see, I get excited. So I seen a thing lately, and it was about um, um, like everybody's looking for the good in a person instead of the real in a person, right? Yeah, and it doesn't matter if that person's bad or good or what they're doing. If you agree with it or not, at least they're being real. Because there's a lot of bad people that can look good and present themselves as good, but they're they're not. You know what I mean? So, like you were just saying, I think. I'd rather know like this person is a shitty person. That's who they are. Da, 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 you know what I mean? Than than being deceived in all these masks we always have to wear. That's part of the problem. We keep wearing these masks and instead of being who we are, whether that's bad or good. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They could stop masking your rating, rating around and just tell people what you really think, so we can deal with problems for what they really are. Yeah, or just, just don't say anything at all. You don't have to. Sometimes well, you don't have to say anything. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Like I'm positive if I'm positive and if I, you know, if I don't have nothing nice to say, just don't say anything. What's the point? Spread negativity. Be positive. Mm-hmm. And read positive things because we getting reported like you wouldn't believe right now, probably. <laughs> <laughs> We're setting all kinds of algorithms off, whatever they're called. <laughs> oh, the <laughs> oh my gosh, did you hear that? He said that the liberals are racist because we need to help black people because their children got problems. Yeah. Be very careful of who you follow. Yeah, you they'll lead you right down that path to hell. But anyway, I think yeah, we should read. That's, true. that's what I, I think I'd we should read too. All right. Because yeah. we all, okay. we didn't even read a chapter yet. <laughs> no, we about That's to go to jail. I, mean, I yeah. started here, and we are right down to the. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, today, 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 that next picture, they're building a detect to detect to hedron. They're building the universe. <laughs> I told you. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. I'm really going to do this. We need to get serious, y'all. Come on. Knowledge. All right. Here we go. All right. One in three becomes one and three. In this way, the number four is born. Cast a glance at the equilateral triangle. In it, you see only one unit, which has three sides, three aspects, all equal. But it contains hidden and unmanifested the number four because the equilateral triangle can be divided up into four smaller equilateral triangles when the triangle moves out of the unmanifested into the manifested state in the three-dimensional world 
a tetrahedron is formed. Right there. Okay. Yep. As you have already seen, the first primordial form of material manifestation, the cube, contains the tetrahedron hidden and unmanifested within itself. Let me hold it up again. You can see that it's a cube. There's there's a cube has six points. Let me get my fit, fat finger out of the way. There's the one point, and then another point up there, and then point up there, point there, point down there, and then down there. So a cube has six points, a three-dimensional figure. And then within it is the tetrahedron, a pyramid with four sides, and each mm -hmm. side has three has three uh, angles on it, three lines. Yeah, because the pyramids, am I frozen? Yeah. The pyramids in Egypt actually have eight sides. They have yeah. four sides and they actually kind of go yeah. in on an angle. Well, th talk about- You can only see it from like the top. But. Talk about threes and fours, that's pyramids. Pyramids are all mm -hmm. about threes yeah. and fours, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. the, the, the base is four, four square. Thank north, south, so east, and west, mm -hmm. and then each side is 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 three. It's it's an equilateral triangle, you know, yep. meeting at the top. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the yeah. four triangles which make up the faces of the tetrahedron are the areas of contact between the divine and the material, as they are identical with the inner areas of the truncated corners of the cube. When we turn the triangles of the tetrahedron outward. With the help of the corners of the cube, thus manifesting the triangles of the tetrahedron, we produce the four-sided shape of the pyramid whose four sides at one and the same time are the four triangles of the tetrahedron turned outward mm -hmm. and the truncated corners of the cube turned outward. The four sides of the pyramid symbolize the four faces of God each of which taken alone and by itself manifests the three aspects of the first source, the divinity at rest within itself and standing above all creation. The pyramid reveals a living reality, the living law in which God always and absolutely manifests himself in the material world. And because he does so, he is indwelling in everything that has been created. From every point of the universe, God manifests himself fourfold. In each of the four directions of the earth and the sky, he radiates with a different effect. And because these streams of force, which originate at one point and yet are so very different, all come forth from the paradisical unity. We can speak of them figuratively as four great rivers springing up in the center of paradise, where the tree of life and the tree of the knowledge of good and evil are rooted and flowing out into the eternal world in four different directions. You will find this fourfold manifestation in everything that has been created, most noticeably in the four characteristics of the great currents of air, the winds, even the dullest person knows that the winds coming from the four different directions have completely different effects. The north wind is dry. It is cool mm -hmm. with a quieting and a paralyzing effect. In many parts of the world, it even makes water hard as stone. The south wind always brings heat and has an arousing, vitalizing effect. The east wind is cool, refreshing. The west wind brings warmth and happiness. In many places, it brings rain. Its effect is fatiguing and soporific. This is something you already know because every child notices the different effects of the four major winds. But have you ever thought about how this is possible? Have you ever wondered how it comes about that currents of air can start at the self-same spot on the surface of the earth and have different effects depending on the direction in which they flow. If, for example, a wind arises right where we are now, where we feel the air to be pleasant and mildly warm, and if it blows southward, it is obviously coming from the north 
for people living in countries to the south of us. It brings them cool weather and has a calming effect on all living creatures. But when a wind starts up from where we are and blows northward, it's a south wind for people living to the north of us. It brings them warm weather and has a stimulating effect on the organs of reproduction of all living creatures. How is it possible for both a cold and a warm wind to originate at one and the same point on the surface of the earth, a tranquilizing and a stimulating or arousing wind, which brings dampness and rain to people on one side and dry weather to people on the other. It all depends on the direction in which the air is flowing. You see, that is the law of space we call the four faces of God. The first face, the north face, is fiery and has a vitalizing effect. That's why the south wind brings heat and stimulates living creatures to conceive new life. The second, the west face, is airy and cool. It makes everything movable, and that's why the east wind is refreshing. The third face of God, his eastern face, is damp, is wet, and lukewarm. It brings heaviness, inertia, warmth, dampness, and precipitation, making all living creatures sleepy. Their consciousness withdraws into their bodies. And lastly, the fourth face, the south face of God, is cold. It has a contrasting, astringent, crystallizing, materializing effect. It brings cold and calms the nerves. The first and most important manifestation <clears throat> of the four faces of God is the fiery one, because the effects of the other manifestations, the other faces, depend on this one. The kind of fire determines whether the weather, whether the weather gets mm -hmm. hot, warm, cool or cold. That's why the fiery face of God is the father of the others. As a result of its radiation, the various specific states arise. The warm and dry together produce the gaseous, airy condition. The cool and damp, the watery, the aqueous. While the cold produces the hard, earthly condition. You find this law operating everywhere here on earth, in every tree, in every plant. Take any house, for example. The south side, which receives the currents from the north face of God, is warm, and plants grow best on this side. Yeah, Gerard. Hi, question. Yeah. While I was in Facebook jail, uh -huh. one of my woman folk friends tagged me in an article, and it said what Rebecca Costello just said. Mm -hmm. And I think it's, it's kind of on topic, but all men are women first. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we all start with, with double X chromosomes. The reason yeah. why we have nipples is mm -hmm. because we're getting ready for something to suck on. And we're getting ready to lactate. Juice is going. So yeah. if all men are women first. <laughs> men is fake news. If men is fake news, then it means that we got a lot of things we need to rethink about when it comes to ancient knowledge, text, and our understanding that God is a creator, isn't necessarily a father, it's more probably like a mother. Because men, nature, God, whatever y'all call it, decided the penises should only exist because the, the, the women need to spread their gene, their DNA around. Run tell that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't even know where to go on this one. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think we're equally as important. I do. Yeah, I think it's a balance. But I think that's how life is created. You have to have both. That's not equal. It's a God that's who created the earth. Right. Creation. No, the God that created the universe and um, the God, the the. the the Shiva looked at his goddess, his, 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 his wife, I mean, his, his goddess wife, and she created it. And, she, and he said, it's all good. Something like that. We were an afterthought. 
we work. We ain't got nothing else to do. We need to make some penis and testicles to go spread some DNA and run around chase the women folk around. It's not equal. I disagree with that. If no. it was equal, God would say, I'm, I'm a man. I'm with man, Alan Watts' equal. version of masculine and feminine. Yes, the yin and the gang. Yes. But yeah. fake news. Fake news. Yeah. Yin and yang are equal. Fake news. Don't bring that to me. That's fake news. The yin and yang are equal. The chicken and the egg didn't come it's first. The family. chicken and the egg can't exist together. Women came first. I'm sorry. It ruins my well, day, too. the chicken and egg exist together? Because I could have a chicken right here, and I could have an egg right here, too. But not, but not in lineage. One had the other. Women made what men. What was first? What was first? The chicken or the Women egg? Women were first. I know. It sounds like a liberal, and I was just getting on the liberals a minute ago, but they right on this one. There's something wrong in the universe, people. Beer, oh, weird. Don't bring this liberal watch of shit. Screw <laughs> <laughs> that. Hey. <laughs> You're not gauging no enough. one's gender tonight, mister. <laughs> hey, hey, the liberals are right on that. They they Everyone pay more homage to the matriarchal exactly. world than the right does. I try to give fire to everybody where it's deserving, but the point yeah. is, there's a lot that we don't understand about this. And yeah. to a degree, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Like to a degree, yeah. to me, it just, it just says gender isn't significant as what we think it is. Yeah. It's, it's not right as right. and all symbols and mysteries, paradox, seeming paradoxes, and they're only they're only mysteries and paradoxes at the level of three D consciousness. Yeah. And every yin is some yang, and in every yang is some yang yin. is some yin. Yeah. yeah. The seed, Otherwise, the yeah. power of the yang resides within the yin, and mm -hmm. the seed power of the yin rides, resides within yeah. the yang energy. That's so sweet and nice, but it don't change the fact that I was a few days from having a vagina. That does not change that fact. You said the yin and the yang together, equal, daddy, daddy, daddy. If the temperature was different, the DNA, chromosome, something happened, these, these titties, they had to form, they had to finish, and I'd have been a woman. I think I think that means we need to re rethink how we think about all this stuff. I kind of think there only is one gender, and it ain't us. That's what I think. I think that we need to really rethink how we think about things. We are, you know, it's like the reptiles. The but reptiles. if we're, well, oh. we're energy, then we're we technically we. I guess I don't want to say it because I'm okay. not going down that well. liberal damn rabbit hole. <laughs> Screw those I agree people. With that. I'm making a stand. No, stand, I mean, girl. there's certain things I am not connecting with. And if I got to repeat it, oh, well, universe, I will. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. I'll repeat it twice. again. Well, so I learned my lesson. You know, one, of, one, of the, one of the principles of natural law <laughs> is, is, is gender, is, is gender polarity. Yeah. But yes. that's it. another thing is this, is that those are masculine and feminine, the god, the goddess, the Chinese say that the Dai Chi symbol. <laughs> no, I need to get another one here. She said, could she call them moves? She didn't call them boobs. She called them men boobs. Moves. <laughs> okay, but you have to remember in the laws of the polarity, right? Like hot and cold, man and woman. There are exactly. opposite uh, uh, ends of the spectrum, but they're still the same thing. Right. See, Susan, you answered it. You actually answered. You resolved it. You finished it for me. I'm done. I'm good. I feel better now. Because we have, what we're came first? We have visuals here. What, in this slide what came first wasn't woman. What came for or female? What came first was spirit, energy, right. vibration, right. Yes. and we have manifested Serpent. many things since then. Right. Even the left and the right, they were kind of manifested. A baby takes on certain identities and nuances and stuff in the environment, changes them. So, but what came first was spirit, was vibration and energy. Everything else was a necessity out of whatever. So I, you know, right. y'all still came first. You, you, you was in the front of the lunch line, got the jello first, but we all went back to being spirits originally. So you answered the question. That was, that was the right answer. You resolved it for me. Apparent opposites. But in in their in their in their essence, we are all identical. Yeah. Yeah, the we're all one. Is, we're, we're all, all of the spirit. One. We're all identical. Nice. And this is and in Genesis, in Genesis one, mm -hmm. uh, when the author of Genesis one is describing the creation. He describes the firmament in the sky. Now the word for firmament means heaven. 
Now, the way that it's des described is the firmament in the in the heaven is a dome which separates the waters above from the waters below. And that is the S, the snake. The, the I, I'm not pointing at it. Right here, the boundary between yeah. yin and yang. Mm. That, what, what divides the waters from the waters, that divides the yin from the yang, mm. is Everything heaven. Is boundary. But how many natures does water have? Two or one? Didn't they discover four? Yeah. One nature. Water is water. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, okay. Good, good yeah, answer. Yeah. Yes. Water is water. Yeah, I mean, and no matter what state it's in, it's still water. It's water. Remember that, yeah, masculine and feminine? But same with us. Masculine will always do be masculine have, and feminine do will they always have be feminine. The same nature, the same essence, the same inner essence. Yes, they do. That's what the Chinese yeah. are saying. And the ancient Hebrews agree with them. The that okay. masculine and feminine have the same inner essence. Yes, they're <laughs> completely different in manifestation. On yeah. spectrums. Because you have a spectrum of well, masculine and feminine inside no. of everybody. So, you know, it, so agree. There, there are firm extremes, and then there are spectrums within. There are masculine uh, women. Yeah, there are masculine yes. feminines, and there yes. are yes. Yes. Uh -huh. but that, that but, way. Yes, like but like, that is not go ahead. In the, yeah, but there are different spectrums. Some women are more masculine, and some men are more feminine. Yeah, so that, that's okay. Right. But don't make it like a five minute gender. But that's so true. Yeah, yeah, I don't no, think that makes any sense. No. I think it's you you're know, you're a man and you top off your penis, off. you're still a man. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're still in man. our water. You're still a man. It's a mental in our water and our food and our air. Yeah, right. yeah. So accepting that there's spectrums of probably those two and probably other things that we don't understand, that there's seven billion different types of human beings on this planet, and they're all resonating where they need to in the time that they need to. Some, you know, they slide down that scope towards masculinity, like you know, women in abusive situations have to. And then when they get out, they slide back to the feminine. Like we're all constantly doing these things. So, you know, I agree with you, Christine. I think it's, it's ignorance to, to define what these universities are doing. Oh, there's five, there's two, there's seven, there's 27. You know, I think it's yeah. you got seven billion different types of spectrum creatures on this planet. That's and they really don't need categorization. They don't need labels. Natural law. That's just another denial of natural law. That's all it is. We should look at comments. We've been okay. running our yeah. miles to each other. Yeah. Although I'm well, kind of scared. Brett Carey said something about the dark being feminine, mm -hmm. which the dark, it, like even in the yin and yang, the light is the male and the, um, I think, right? Yeah. The light's the male. Yeah. And the dark's the female. Mm -hmm. But um, so Alan Watts says a great thing about that, right? Mm -hmm. Like you have to have the darkness in the background. You have to have the ethereal. You have to have the um, the non physical, right? Yeah. Like, um, in order to 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 bring things into the matter, you you have to have that in the background. That's so, crazy. like, <laughs> so like, if you have a black, you can't see the stars unless the night is black. That too. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So it's it's kind of like, in my opinion, whatever from what I've learned. So the feminine is kind of like the inspiration, right? It's what inspires, what it's the emotions, it's the feelings. And then the male, the masculine is the more doer, the mm -hmm. more um, bringing right. it into reality. Right. And, and that's why you have to have that balance because the feminine can nurture and the feminine, um, yeah. yes. you know, inspires. The, the and it also it. keeps them grounded. Yes. Yeah, the feminine ground thing, because if we are not there, the man cannot manifest anything. Anything. Mm -hmm. True. Nothing. True. Because it's Saturday, we aren't <laughs> doers. We're lazy. We don't want to get up and watch TV and hang out, eat some breakfast. And the woman you ain't getting nothing, you got to cut that grass. And you got to get out there and cut that grass. Your butt and outside, go pick up the house and move it mm -hmm. over to the left. That's exactly what Christine said. The doers, you ain't going to get up and do until she said you ain't getting nothing. You get out there and take that trash out. 
Yeah. But I mean, don't take me wrong. I'm not saying women just lay around all day like, I'm inspiring you. (laughs) Well, they do that. Some of them do that too. I see. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, they do. Some of them. Women have to do too. It's just, yeah, it's different. Yeah. Yeah. But you're supposed to do twice a day because that's healthy. You got to get it moving through you. Twice a day, do. Yeah. Okay. I think you're taking my statement. (laughs) <laughs> that's what we do that's the job you, just, <laughs> you take the statement and you let the statement do what it's supposed like the snake between the yin and the yang you're supposed to let the snake in the pyramid and do what they do with the four gods okay we're going let it somewhere. do what it do baby it's not a soda somewhere. is that the pepsi logo let it do what is, is coke gonna change their logo they're gonna change it what is their motto <laughs> I'm sorry. This is why I don't do social media no more. Y'all I'm done. I'm the, this is literally. How did I become a good one? I'm going to say me and Christine. Nothing so good to say from this conversation. <laughs> What's up? What? Nothing so good to say from this conversation, Jonathan. <laughs> what I miss? Christine, you okay, darling? What's wrong? <laughs> You okay? She won't die no heart attack, not baby. What's going on? You okay? Well, he's too involved point? for you people. Do you get it? She's so too I'm what? Evolved. She has involved? sensibilities. Yes. No. no. Well, she's no, mature. Was, no, we're, we're, we're being silly. No, I was thinking about Socrates he watching our conversation. <laughs> so I was asking oh. Oh. <laughs> What was your question? No, I was about Socrates. What did Socrates think yeah. about our conversation? <laughs> he <didn't like> this. <laughs> he probably said, Oh, oh, I've got a I've got a question for y'all. No, he'd probably be like, you guys read my shit and this is what you're saying? <laughs> I really, I wasted my, all, all them robes and sandals. I spent, and that I spent years in exile in Egypt for this. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's get back. Okay. <laughs> all right. Should I read some more? Again? I think you should. I don't, yeah. I'm scared of where this might end up. Okay. Yeah, Gerard's being naughty. <laughs> Blaming it on him. It's his fault. It's his I'm fault. not I deny it. I don't, it. It's the fries or the food or something. GMO. I'm not sure what it is. My my eyes, third eyes. I told you it's closed. I'm being silly tonight. <laughs> All right. I need food. All right, go ahead. Okay, here we go. Okay. Uh, this, let me find, find the place here. Yeah, okay. That's why the fiery face of God is the father of the others. As a result of its radiation, the various specific states arise. The warm and dry together produce the gaseous, airy condition. The cool and damp, the watery or the aqueous, while the cold produces the hard, earthy condition. <clears throat> You find this law operating everywhere here on earth, in every tree, in every plant. (coughs) Take any house, for example. The south side, which receives the currents from the north face of God, is warm, and plants grow best on this side. (coughs) The north side is cold. The east side is dry, (coughs) and the west side is always damp. Whenever we make rain in the pyramid, the precipitation hits all buildings from the west. <clears throat> this fourfold aspect is not only to be found in the major winds, but in everything that has been created. Look at the trees. The north side, exposed to the radiation from the cool southern face of God, is always covered with moss. Have you ever wondered why the human being has only one face? And that, it's always towards the front. In the direction in which we face, we are fiery, giving, whereas when we turn our back on something, we are cool towards it. Our limbs, too, are all directed forward, and we can radiate our willpower only in the direction in which we are facing. And why do we sleep best when lying in a north to south direction? Why do all animals lie down this way? Why are even birds' nests and anthills built in a north-to-south direction? 
Animals have no intellect to understand the reasons why, but they feel the effects of quieting radiations coming from the north and vitalizing currents from the south. Instinctively, they feel it's best for the circulation of their own current of life when they build their nests in a north to south direction and when they sleep this way. That's the secret of why a person who is seeking connection with God and praying should face north or east, but never south or west. In the north and in the east, he can find forces that lead him towards spiritualization, whereas in the south and in the west, he finds stimulation, which leads his consciousness to identify itself with his sense instincts. <clears throat> the effect of God's fourfold radiation are always the same throughout the entire universe. Every point in the universe, and this includes, of course, every point on the face of the earth, always receives exactly the same radiation from any given direction. The four faces of God can never turn or shift. They always stand unchanged, immutable, facing in their own original direction. Wherever members of the divine race went, they taught the sons of men this profound truth in various ways, depending on the characteristics of the people around them. Here, where people understand geometric forms and can grasp truth intellectually, we expressed the truth about the four faces of God in the form of the pyramid. But there are other traces, there are other races of people more inclined to grasp divine truths as spiritual experiences. The members of our race who fled to such countries have built gigantic figures of stone to represent divinity in the form of a human figure sitting like a triangle and having a head with four faces, one looking in each direction. Both representations reveal the same fact. <clears throat> Whenever the divine creative principle leaves its timeless, spaceless condition in the unmanifested state to come out into the three-dimensional world and become matter, it manifests itself even while keeping its three aspects. It manifests itself in the number four. The shape of the pyramid shows this clearly in that each of its four sides, standing on the square base, forms a triangle representing the three aspects of God. Thus, the pyramid manifests four times three, the number 12. And that it reduces to three. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. And that brings us to another truth. As you can see from the symbolic representation in the form of the pyramid, each of the four faces of God contains the three divine aspects. This results in a 12 fold manifestation, which is present at every point of the universe and is acting in everything that exists, beginning with the individual creatures living on the planets and running through the planets to the suns and the systems of suns throughout the universe, just like little circles in larger ones, and larger circles in still larger ones, on and on into infinity. So if you understand one of these circles, you will understand the inner structure of the entire universe and of every single creature in it. For the entire visible universe is based on this 12-fold manifestation of God. But before we go on, you must realize that everything we human beings can perceive with our organs of sense from our personal point of view, that is, from the outside, is the exact opposite of what exists in the divine state of being. Everything you can see when looking at it from the outside, whether from above or below, from front or back, from the right or the left, turns into its exact opposite as soon as you stop looking at it and start being it. When you look at something, you're in a dualistic relationship to it. You, the observer, and what you see are two different poles. But when you are something, you are in a monistic 
condition. You are in divine unity. To show you an example, let's take a letter, say of the letter E. In what direction does this letter run? It runs from left to right, Father. Answer, good, says Tahotep. Now, when I draw the same letter on your breast so that you are this letter, you are in a condition of unity with it, in a state of being with it. In what direction is it running now? From right to left, Father, I answer. Yes, just the opposite. Come with me now, and I'll show you something more. Tahotep leads me under <clears throat> two large circular plates that hang from the ceiling and serve as lamps. They both have the same 12 pictures, but running in opposite sequence and facing in opposite directions. There, we go. there are pictures. There's one, he uh, there's one here, and then there's one right down here. Okay. And of course, you'll let me let me get let me zoom that in closer. You can probably see on that let it focus there the twelve signs of the zodiac. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, in this plate, they're in going in one direction, and then here we go find find it there. There it is. On that one, they're proceeding in the opposite direction. Okay. Did anybody else get that matrixy looking fractal fractal pattern when he was holding that up there? It looks like it was yeah. vibrating. Not that one, the other one. There we go. Right here. See? Yes. Yes. Aha! They were breaking the matrix. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing it. Uh, I know. I know. We'll do. So. But we can try. <laughs> Is that is that like the fractal thing that plays with your eyes? It does the weird thing when you look at it. I don't know, but it was cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably it's a kind of uh, you have to mandala mandala. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. See. So. Yeah. So at, uh, at the, the the one the one here down here on this page, um, Aquarius <clears throat> in the in the. Um, the north position, Leo is in the south position. Mm -hmm. I just used two examples. And then mm -hmm. on, on the one up here, they're reversed. Leo is in the north position and Aquarius is in the south position. So everything is inverted. Upside switched. down. Mirror, mirror, mirror version. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So the upside down cool. one is the one that like crazy, right? It's like when you actually look. Is it, yeah. Uh, yeah, like today's know. world and the illusions. Well, you can't it's, see it's right. Like, it's, it's like when you when you read something in a mirror, yeah. you know. Or mm -hmm. if I hold this is a perfect example. I'm holding this up to the camera. You guys are seeing it it uh, this way, but when I'm looking at it, I'm looking at it the opposite. The other way. Everything is. Yeah, and flip. and flip another, upside down. See, another example is in your eyes. Yes, yes, I was thinking because that's in your eyes. Um, the light, uh, it's been a while yeah, since I've actually get, looked at it. It comes eyes. in and then turns back upside down and yeah. goes back yeah. out. Yes, yeah. yeah. yes. A first lesson, like, yeah. uh, tup -tup and then, yeah, yeah. Now, all of this stuff is manifested in different ways in the physical yeah. world, yeah. Yeah, and our eyes, Maya. our eyes are connected to our brains, and they are the perceivers of this physical reality. It is how we perceive the universe. It's the first, you know, it goes in and then reflects back out. So it's almost like you are the universe because you're processing it and putting it back out, but you're also in it in the universe. Does that make sense? Right. They must be talking politics or something. I don't. I don't explain it as good as the sages do. George, George I know what I'm look saying. On his face. He's going to say something. He's, he's getting. He's getting charged up. He's going to say something. No, I'm going to be good. No, I've decided I'm going to be good. I'm reformed. Okay. I'm reformed. I'm. I'm not going to help the recidivism rate and join in the discussion. I spoke my two cents. I don't know. Uh, 
No, they're just having a discussion. They're okay. Uh, oh. okay. They look all all loving people. Everybody loves Jesus, okay. love mama, okay. grandmama, and Buddha Shiv and everybody. Just okay. everyone has their own perspectives and they're okay. sorting their things out. And it's good. It's good. Okay. All right. Yeah. I'm I'm resonating more and more in, in more of a hidden realm perspective. perspective. I think the, the esoteric is more mysterious and more interesting and more powerful than like sometimes I think they give us these things in this matter world to mm -hmm. get us to convince ourselves that these things matter. And I think more and more we need to focus yeah, to on keep us in the matter. Keep us in the matter. Like they can keep you focused. Because I find like when I started like really thinking about a lot of this stuff, <clears throat> you know, I, I would go down the pathway and kind of accept we're all one, da 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 da. You know, we all come from the great oneness, whatever. And then the real world, you know, you watch TV, you watch the news or politics or your friends or something, and you kind of get pulled back in to being seriously debating things of the world of matter. Mm -hmm. And I think that's one of the way that they keep us captive in the matrix is getting us to fight each other in the matrix yeah. like the matrix is real. And it's not, not just from a Rockefeller science, medicine, you know, economical perspective, but also from the realms, right? They need us not thinking in the spiritual energy realm. They need us to focus and believe in this realm, this biological matter realm. It was like what you said a minute ago, Susan, which is um, Susan or Christine. If, you know, we manifest our reality, and I don't think we understand how powerful we are. No, if we don't. We continue to resonate in the matter world passionately then that is what's going to matter to us. And we, we stay trapped in this realm to a degree. So I, I'm just trying to, as much as possible, resonate more in a, a spiritual, spiritual way. Mm -hmm. But, like, because we say get lost in the matter, right? And the matter is not all bad. You know what I mean? Because, I mean, our, our world is beautiful. Our earth is beautiful. Like, it, it, it really is. Even just a simple flower in where in New Jersey, where I live, is beautiful, you know? So, matter's not all bad. But it, it's the way, I mean, it's our indoctrination and everything. Our mm -hmm. minds are not free. If we actually thought of, um, <clears throat> like, we're free and, and tried to connect more to more spiritual you know, or understand frequencies more or whatever, the matter world wouldn't be the way it is right now. The matter world would be, we would control the matter world, but now the matter controls us. Right. Because we are dependent on the matter instead of not knowing that we are actually creating the matter, more or less. Right. And that's yes. why, yeah. Yes, he is. Yes. Yeah. It really is that these differences which you know masculine and feminine up down right left dark light good and evil mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they only exist in consciousness but that's why you say think positive and um, yeah it's like yeah think positive and, and you create a positive world so you don't but if you the chinese right. say chinese say the daichi is the wuchi yeah Uche! Yeah. I like the word Wuchi. I'm sorry. But, and you were saying control the matter. I don't think it's even about control the matter. It's create, like you said, create the matter. Yeah. I'm going to control this tea, though. And, and if our minds were on a different mindset, I guess you could say, yeah. the matter we created would be different. Yes. Like, we wouldn't have street wires everywhere. We would have a few pyramids and megalithic sites around the planet. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That were made of too. stone. And because I know it, I know it with all my being that they harvested some kind of natural energy around the world and had really cool shit. Yeah, and is, nothing got is. polluted. <laughs> it's true. That's still, I, I know that it is. with my whole entire That body. was the, the cause. But it's, that's, it's, it's set in that initiation initiation book that yeah. uh, the pyramids are the the energy is is the god is the god divine energy that was captive in the pyramids but they did destroy it or they did hide it mm -hmm. Ooh, tower of babylon how it applies yeah. right so it, i, I, it I think that that's happened yeah. many times 
right? You have to, when people start coming together in greatness, because that's the only way we'll be great is together, right? With unity. We start building towers to the gods. We start manifesting the power, like Christ said, greater things I have done, you will do. We start doing the things our ancestors did. We have that power. And there's always the powerful that need to destroy that tower and destroy the greatness. We can become together. So they divide us up. They give us different languages, different skin colors, different anything they can give us, religions, anything <coughs> to get people fighting each other again. And this is why, you know, I, I catch flack from people, but I'm, I don't believe in identity. I think it's all bullshizzle. And I think that if if the people who enslave the world want me to be a thing, I'll never be that thing ever again. I am me, and I'm going to know what me is. I'm sure isn't designated by robber barons and slave masters and, and colonizers or kings, whether that be in Africa or Ireland. I don't give two damns what they think. You know, I'm trying to discover me. But the point is, is that we're divided up, and that is their real power. They have no power other than our belief, and we're not one. And we shouldn't work together. What they bank on is us thinking that I am, I am this, I'm not this. I'm this, I'm this team over here, but I'm not this team over here. And yeah. there's nothing but war and conflict and competition. Every struggle is against yourself, whether you yeah. believe it or not. Right. Everything you fight is against yourself. We're all a part of one. That's why I have no, I have no conflict. With it. I have no fights. All this drama that's happened between our friends on Facebook and some of them here. I, I'm, I'm not picking a team. You know, to me, it's ridiculous. Right? Brett, Where says, is Brett says, if you don't understand distinctions, you fell for the PSYOP. That's it. Absolutely. If you, if you don't understand, they created distinctions for one reason. Mm -hmm. Rob you of your power. Well, it's distinctions themselves. To, to have distinctions themselves. I mean, to have dark and light itself is not in itself evil or deceptive. It presents us with the opportunity to have consciousness. Because like I said last week, in order to have consciousness at all, you have to have two things. Does that make sense? You guys follow me? Yeah. So in order to have consciousness at all, you have to, exist, to have you have to have two things. And the, the, uh, the, the, the Yaki shaman, Juan Matus, says you have to take, he compares this to like the inventory of shit in your head. You have to take the inventory in the warehouse. You don't have to worship it. You don't have to believe it. You don't have to think. I am over here. I'm a Democrat and you're a Republican and you can fuck off. You don't have to play that game. You don't have to worship the contents <clears throat> of consciousness. Because you're in the world. Those, all of those distinctions dissolve in the infinite. Poochie, poochie, That's what I was singing at work today. Poochie. Poochie. There ain't no good guys. There ain't no bad guys. There's only you and me, and we just disagree. It's a good song. See? Mm -hmm. That's where we are. Right. Maybe thinking mean. Democrats and Republicans. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I sang that at work yeah. today. I think Kate you Casey did. Put, heard me all the way down and plumbing. <laughs> Did they tell you you can come back Monday, or did they say? No, <laughs> no they love my singing. Like Susan, you can't do that here. You can't not here. Yeah, I do it anyway. Whatever. Spread joy everywhere I go. <laughs> so it it takes me back to the scripture, right? You're in the world. You're not of the world. And there are certain realities, right? And and I get people who are still resonating with the identities. I get that, right? Yeah. There are very real problems that they want to address. But the thing is, is that I personally feel that they're unaddressable within an identity. Right? Because if you're within that identity and I'm not, then you've given me every reason to not trust you. Right? Why would I, you know, trust someone of a different identity? I might like you, I might work with you, I might whatever, but if you 
embrace team cowboy and I'm team redskin, at the end of the day, we're still in competition, right? With the acceptance that this is who I am and that's who you say you are. So like to me, when, when I think of I'm in the world, but I'm not of the world, I accept that I'm in the world. And I accept that people are going to treat me a certain way based on how I talk, how I yep. look, where I walk, where I'm from, what my religion is. Yep. But as far as me treating anybody else that way, I do my best every day to escape that. I don't judge a person at all by how I perceive them. Because perception, to a large degree, it's evolved. Right? It comes from times of scarcity where as predator prey, you represent something as a threat or as food. Right. And we're still kind of trapped in that monkey mind, reptilian brain survival of the fittest. Do I need to eat you or can I trust you or, um, or do I need to run from you? So people are still doing this perception as I think. But um, I'm, you know, I'm not going to say I'm there, but I'm in a place where I don't judge anybody as friend or foe by looking at them and the car they drive or, or, or the color right. or their gender. Um, you know, there's still judgment that happens, and I can't stop that to a degree. You still, you know, you look at the clothes someone has on, and your mind makes certain decisions based on the clothes they have on, but we don't have to act on those decisions. So, anyway, that's how I view You know, you we are in the world, but we're not of Well, I think also there's, like, so, like, judgment, for me, judgment is, like, I, I, I give you a hierarchy or a level of like what you're worth <laughs> by me, you know what I'm saying? Like whether you're less than or above or, you know, the same, but, and, and that's judging. Right. But I think that you do assess people. Like you have to assess like this person's very, you know, got a lot of negative energy. I don't think I'm less than him or, or better than him, but, but, but I don't need that in my life. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sense. Explain that well. Yeah. Okay. You can, you can be neutral, neutral, neutral without judging, but right. not going and getting involved in drama. Right. Without right. also not saying it's good, but it's not good. At, I mean, just keep out of right. it and let it play itself out. Let it play itself out. Right. Yeah. Right. And it doesn't hey, mean I'm, like I'm, you know. I'm a masculine or I'm a feminine. I'm a male or a female. In terms of your physical nature, in terms mm -hmm. of the contents of your mind but to forget that our essence transcends all differences our mm -hmm. essence transcends all opposites and this is where we came from that right. this is really what's behind all of this yeah we That's came what's from behind the us. we came <laughs> from the <Wuchi. laughs> Every man knows that. We came yeah. from the Wuchi. We respect and love the Wuchi. You got to love the Wuchi. Wuchi why we get up there. Yeah, Jonathan, morning. he didn't mean it like you meant it. <laughs> just gonna warn you. But you shouldn't have known. Why do I he try just, season? He's just like that and drops off. <laughs> he just throws the bomb and then he head, heads out the back. What is that? Yeah. I know. He just I'm out of here. All right. Yeah. Let me say this and I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> um Elaine said discernment. That was the word. Yeah, discernment, discernment. is not judgment. Yes. Yeah, because a lot of people yes. judge. Right. And then there's some people that just discern what's good well, for them you know, and what's not. You know what I mean? Uh, discernment and detachment. Non-attachment. You know, to get to get attached means to get attached to your labels, to yes, get attached to your physical being, yeah. to get attached to uh, the way your mind works, you know? Oh, I'm, you know, I, I'm, you know, fire and earth in my chart, and not, that's who I am. No, it's not. What yes, it are, is. You, what <laughs> yes, you are, yes. this. Yeah. you're this. But that, that's how you manifest your... It, it is how you manifest, and it is but what you have to work with. It's not what you are, yeah. It's what yeah, you have to work with. It. And, and maybe those are, those are the lessons that you need to learn Right, right now but what we are in our in our original nature is the 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 yeah. wuchi, the, the unmanifested but going back to uh drama or not drama of, of um doing right or not right and then i'm thinking about socrates about punishment if people are 
doing really very, very wrong and they get punished. Then there was a discussion that's good or not good. But I think if they, um, if they get corrected, they don't have to go that far. But then there is still, then, then we have, then we are at point of what is ethic and what is moral. Like, like I was just repeating what you, you were reading yeah. in your uh, Socrates of Plato. What is it? Yes. And yeah. that's the, the thing. Place. So, yes. because that's mm -hmm. why. The, the, the bad world can just continue. They don't get any kind of consequence right. for their deeds. They just... Right. So that's why the world is going to... Boom. Nobody yeah. says anything. And if you say something, then you're racist. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you do. If, uh -huh. I mean, it's the, 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 the game between the Democrats and the Rep Republicans. <laughs> Meanwhile, mm -hmm. the evildoers they just keep on doing evil. Keep doing the evil. Yeah. yeah. Do. So mm -hmm. they don't get punished. Mm -hmm. No. But right. but therefore karma will. But then uh, yeah. But if and then the thing is what I was concluding, if they get punished, their karma will be more reduced. But yeah, so we don't help them by not no. punishing them. No. Yeah, because we actually send. Because um, I was watching Randall Carlson um, after school did a clip of one of his um things, his lectures, and um, now he goes by geological evidence. So this right. is. This is like hard science, right? Yeah. <clears throat> and um, so he mapped out every time there was a major cataclysmic event on Earth. And it always happens when we enter the winter, um, some when we en enter the, the equinoxes or the solstices yes. of the 26,000 year cycle, which we are entering right yes. now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, um, and I think it also ties into, because it's always an age, right? Like a major age change sure. where something major shift happens. Mm -hmm. Society is a collective that changes our behavior on earth or our way of life on earth. You know what I mean? And, and I, I think we attract that energy in. I think it doesn't hit us when we're, we're, we're putting out a, a better energy, but because like we talked True. about manifestation and everything, like, True. like even us always talking about comets, like we can manifest that. If we keep saying we're going to get it, we're going to get hit. I want a comet. You yeah. are telling the universe you want a comet. You know what I mean? So yeah, I'm just true. saying, <laughs> I don't know where yeah. I'm going, but whatever. <laughs> no, it made sense. It made sense. Yeah. <laughs> Start mm -hmm. thinking about those menace damn right. comet, right? Because one's um, passing by us today and it's coming back in 2020. Yeah, Sam Hancock seven posted years. that today. Yeah, mm -hmm. seven years of tribulation, seven, right? right. Yeah. Seven now to 29, that's about seven years. All I'm saying is we better get our shit together or we're gonna be wiped out by a damn comet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, I, there's, there's a lot of speculation <laughs> that the pyramids are actually technology that was used to push uh, asteroids, comets, and other small planetary bodies away from what? the Earth. Yeah, yeah, I mm -hmm. can believe that. Yes. Possibly. Possibly. I, I'm certainly not denying that that, that possibility does exist. No, because even Graham Hancock and, and Randall Carlson say that we do have technology where it because you, you just have to like hit it a little bit to change the orbit a little bit to miss us. So we do yeah. have that technology yeah. right now. Yeah. 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 If they can kill a whole fleet of whales with solar yeah. techn sonar technology, yeah, they can yes. use sonar you to move that thing a little. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But but Jupiter, the planet Jupiter, is the planet who is benevolent to the Earth. So whatever there is a meteor or a coming, it can change that orbit from the meteor so it doesn't hit the Earth. Yeah. Um, that's what, yeah, that's the quality of Jupiter, my guru said. Yeah, I Jupiter takes well, a, um, a lot uh, of comments right. for us. Yeah. Graham Asteroid. Hancock says that Jupiter and Saturn are our shields. You know the the, uh, the what was the 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 large the really big cometary impl impact on Jupiter that happened what five years ago now? Yeah. Uh, what was it called? I don't remember, but I know what yeah. you're talking about. I know because yeah, it came up on on it Hubble did. or whatever. It did. Yeah. That was even real. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
<laughs> I question everything, man. I can't take it. <laughs> you only have their word to go on. You know? Exactly. You have their word to go on. And uh, that that commentary impact was a major one. And mm -hmm. because of, gra uh, of, of gravity and Jupiter and Saturn's immense gravitational pull out there, they draw a lot of that stuff in. And mm -hmm. they protect. So, uh, you know, all the, the, the larger planets do anyway. There he is. He's back. Isn't that what they, isn't that what they call Jupiter the perturber? Something like that. He was just in a gang fight. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I haven't had it with y'all. Y'all He just, <laughs> <laughs> just made a drug deal. <laughs> <laughs> Are you damn right I did. Hell yeah, I'm still his name. Oh, that Cartel shit. I'm, I'm making deals. No, bro, I'm fine. I ain't playing. Making deals. I don't believe in money, but I'm gonna make some deals. Got to make some deals. You got to make okay. some deals. Know what I'm saying. Okay. <laughs> Is that your scary Sam Jackson face? Yeah. Yeah. Well, so you got to have a scary face. Everybody, every woman knows that, and every person from a pole community know that. You got to have a scary face. Now you got to sometimes know how to scare people and run. <laughs> Okay, I'm oh, sorry. Scary. What were you saying? <laughs> you know, I cut you off to make a joke. You had a naked joke. No, I cut you off to make a joke. Make a joke. Oh, oh. But it's There's getting late for Christine's. We should probably wrap it up. Money in the comments, so. Yeah. What happened? We should probably start wrapping up soon because Christine, yeah, it's really it's, late. It's an hour. We're an hour and forty minutes now. So. No, but where Christine is, it's oh, yeah. like two a.m. Is one, it? one 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 fifteen p.m. Okay, one fifteen. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, did we learn anything yet? A.m. Yeah. You can't leave school. Did we learn anything yet? <laughs> this was a chaotic class. <laughs> oh my god. You, you yeah. haven't seen the comments. You 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 have not even seen the comments. No, I didn't see your comments. You no, I was Jumping from. It'll be fun going back later and reading. Yeah. yeah, I was in the slave yeah. making a deal and I was reading the comments. I was like, boy, I tell you what, they still going. So <laughs> all are doing the peace, love, hippie stuff. They're down there having some discussions and situations. Yeah. They yeah. got to handle some things. Verna, yeah, you can. If yeah. my guru, Verna, yes, if you want, you can meet the guru if you want. She says, I want to meet your guru. Was it Verna? Yeah, Verna. Who said that, just, Verna? I don't yeah, want to meet Verna? anybody. Verna, oh. yes, you have to you have to just Google sahajayoga.com and you find info. gurus make you feel stupid. I don't want to meet my guru, I don't want to meet him. He makes you feel stupid. Because you ask him, no matter what you ask him, he always turns it into another question which makes you look stupid. Yeah, and he walks I make myself look, I make yeah. myself look yeah. We have to yeah. be willing to be stupid. Yeah, yeah. Right. Because I have we to, are yeah. stupid. We are we're hundred percent stupid. Absolutely. When I'm stupid. done making myself stupid, then I'm open myself to the guru making me look stupid too. Right now I'm doing a pretty damn good job myself. I'm teaching myself a whole lot. But I don't want to uh, wait, I wanted to say yeah. make it rain in the pyramids. See, we can geoengineer without poisoning the shit out of everybody. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah, that's what I did. The, the pyramids were actually kind of geoengineering. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that was the name of the comment. Yeah, they did. Yeah. They actually did. Yeah. So well, they, they know geoengineering is already existing. Million. And yeah, I come how many times? Uh, two, um, six thousand, twelve thousand, fifteen thousand years ago. The pyramids they did that geoengineering. Right. Yeah, I was. I was like holy shit because this is what i've been saying for years that these pyramids do things nobody let's turn them on yeah but let's now figure it out not turn them on we don't know what they do I just said we only know what they do why would we turn them on <laughs> 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 at this point what is the worst that could happen oh no we were right oh, they do crazy oh, stuff. Boom. oh it can get worse than this it can get a whole lot where no no less no. less less uh, think. Uh, less i have faith no, no, no y'all just want to play start pressing right. buttons. No, you ain't Homer Simpson. This is not what we're doing. Just start pressing buttons. Just unplug it and plug it back in and see what happens. 
<laughs> and then the aliens come, Thoth wake the hell up, get the attitude because you woke Good. up two thousand years Good. too early. He start death Good. rays come out of his eyes. No, that man don't. <laughs> He's brainwashed. Mm. Sheepy things need some God up their butt. <laughs> <laughs> Do you even know what Thoth looks like? People, no. like, we sit by when he comes sit out with that out. Ivan's head and is like, hey, yeah. you're all idiots. I ain't writing you down in the tree life. Then maybe people will change. <laughs> but you're with us. You understand that you with us? We all one. We all connected. We both take his belt off and we get ready to spank everybody. You couldn't spank nope. us. No, because they'll eat you out of no. existence and keep your shit up. Watch. That alligator, that, that alligator god is going to go right down. Yeah. Alligator, yeah. You have not even seen the alligator god. No. No. He said, they said that when they asked the Egyptians who built the pyramid, they said the alligator gods. Have you, have you swam with an alligator? Let alone an alligator god. Rebecca has. I'll no. take her with me. <laughs> <We'll be fine. laughs> Rebecca, take care of <laughs> Rebecca ain't got no time for you. Uh-uh. Rebecca know what to do. She got to make the noise and the crocodile turn around. She just like it or something. It come right at you. No, I ain't messing with a crocodile guy. Let's let those sleep. Because first of all, we don't know why he was sleepy. He could have been tired, needed a nap or something. You ever go wake your uncle up or something and like, nah, you wake up, punch you in the eye. No, leave those, let him stay asleep. So we figure out, we got to figure us out. We still fighting over penises and vaginas, people. We still fighting over <laughs> skins and gods. We still fighting yeah, over flags the, the, the nations okay. that are just crests of, of the, the, every flag of every nation, just a crest of another family. People still fighting over cloth and fabric. Damn it, they fighting over shoes in New York City. We ain't got no time to wait. Throw, you don't wait those up for this job. Sorry, this is going to be sunny time. Toilet paper. Yeah. Sorry, this is going to be sunny time. You going to catch some cases, but hell no. Let that man sleep. No, no, we're not ready, Susan. No, no y'all can just break. Out of existence, no. like it never happened. Right. Blink, blink. I know. Zahi Hawass, if you are watching and you ever see Susan in your country, you <laughs> the pyramids. Cause she gonna wake him up and he gonna catch it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. She gonna wait. She gonna press the. She gonna go in the pyramid, put her hand in the in the in print or something, and pyramid start glowing. Mm -mm, no, no. Let's bait. Let's let's think for a little bit. We need to drink okay. smoothies a little bit longer. Okay, so just for the reading things though. Okay, yeah. yeah. So I had make rain in the pyramid, and um, Jackie um, mentioned about. Something, some part being in the oh, emerald no, tablet. No, no. Yeah. Go back. Go Slow back. though. <laughs> what, what, rank the pyramid. Hold on. Go back. Explain that again. Okay. Some point in the book. <laughs> you go too damn fast. Slow down, woman. Am I bringing Get excited. I know when is y'all. Slow down. Just slow down a little bit. Slow down. <laughs> Explain yourself. All right. This what makes me happy. Makes my energy. <laughs> Y'all well, need to slow down just a little bit. Now explain this rain in the pyramid thing. I need to because I'm look. I'm loving this. I don't know how they it made it rain in the pyramid. John hasn't read it. It said it, they make rain in the pyramid. They made the pyramids made it rain for made the it crops rain. to grow well, in yeah. Egypt. Yeah. yeah, and that's actually that's what from they did. a couple of different places. That yeah. yeah. See, that's how that's how that's a, that's like, I said, let's turn them on and be natural rain. Right. Yeah. yeah. Like some and? will home. See what's fascinating to me about that is because now you're getting into things Tesla said. You're getting into things that Will Home Reich and the rest of these guys were talking about yeah. and yes. making these weather machines and the farmers back in the 40s before they classified it and they started changing the weather. And JFK said, Y'all never better do that because you're going to change the climate in the future. Now the climate's changing. And everybody listened to that little 10 year old girl instead of JFK, Nikola Tesla, and the pyramid people. <laughs> that was Greta that matters. <laughs> Greta matters. All that fits together. It all fits together. It's all related. Greta matters. Mm -hmm. um, oh, was that Greta? Yeah, Van Greta. Susteren. Oh, and um, so because you said the four faces of God, right? Yeah. And there's the four elements, the four cardinal directions, the four corners of a pyramid, um, the four seasons. So I do think the the four is what ties us into, I guess, like the matter. Yeah. And then the goal is, the, is yeah. to break is over four to is the four. It's the number yeah. of the matter, yes. Four right. is the number of matter, yes. Okay. Absolutely. Manifestation. 
Yeah. Okay. Procreation too. Yeah. And eight is the master number, the mm -hmm. number of leader. Mm -hmm. If you can handle it or, or it could be also destructive. If you cannot yeah. handle that right. number, then it destroys you. Yes. Yeah. I eight know. That's my life path number. number and it sucks. Yeah, I wrote a lot of eight and four and eight and uh, I didn't get it yet. Yeah. No, not at all. It's some bullshit. <laughs> I couldn't have been a nine. Yeah, I'm nine. Transcended easily. Yeah, see? He's nine, of course. <laughs> <laughs> it's stuck with difficult F8. <laughs> All right, should I read a little bit more or or um, we haven't even gotten into this chapter yet? I, I know, but Christine is getting tired. Christine, yeah, get that getting look like, uh, <laughs> no ideas. Well, no I can, yeah, and we we've can actually been on here for four hours. Yeah, we can take two. this. We can actually return <laughs> to this chapter next that's time we're on. That's what preachers and professors do the same damn thing. They think they've been there for 30 minutes. Like, it's only been 45 minutes. We're going to keep praising Jesus. Yeah. Why sing enough song, get together, you know, <laughs> altar card and pastor, you and then five, five yeah. altar calls, pastor. You've already done five. The money, nobody got no more money. Like, oh, are we going to do one more? Let's wrap it up. One more. No, the football game about to start, pastor. And professors the same way. Time flies for them when they teach him. Yeah. You back there just like. I'm going to be racist, realize, right? <laughs> White uh -huh. church. <laughs> White church is like 45 minutes and oh, black church that. is like yes. eight hours. Oh, <laughs> you know what? Real, real talk, real story. I took my family out of a black church. I said, hell no, we ain't doing this. I got I got Kung Fu matinee I got to get home on Sunday to watch when I was a kid. So I took my family away from the church we went to to another church because it's a good white church. They got the times and the clocks and the watches. Like, look, let's get in, get out. <laughs> All right, we ain't doing this flow with the spirit stuff. That's no, yeah, no, no. Because I, I, there I look, ain't no Holy Ghost in here. Look, keep that Holy Ghost at the door. All right, we got to get out at a certain time, Pastor. We got a schedule to keep. In Black Church, they let the Holy Ghost do anything the hell he want. I mean, the, the music is good though. That's why, because you're in that yeah. church. The church is happy. You're like, oh, Dancing, yeah. oh, you just get going. You know, somebody go out there and pass that, pass out. You know, people healing, <laughs> smacking their foreheads. Getting up, dancing from wheelchairs, and you feel it. Yeah, you, then you feel realize it you've been in there for four hours. Yeah, and then and you stop you, feeling it. Yeah, and like I need to go to a white church, yeah, Mama. Like, I'm I tired now. Nothing done with it. In black no. church, they have you in there seven days a week. I used to be in church seven days a week. Oh my gosh, seven man. days. It was always something. The pastor knew how to always get it. Well, we got to do this. Then we got to do this. Then we got to fix this. Then we got to grow this and fix that. Do this. Do do do. We got to have this meeting. That meeting. Bible study. This that that. This is why I can't do cuss church no more. I can't run with the cuss church people. Besides, they beefing with the other gang anyway. So you know, there is that. Yeah. Hopefully, y'all ain't wrapped up in that mess. They in there fighting nope. it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's we are not even gonna start that. Let's just. Nope. All right. There we go. Now we said everything to get us banned on Facebook again. <laughs> are, are we still on? I don't know. I they, think they, so. Oh, we're still we here. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. I don't think we we didn't, we didn't go too bad. I mean, we, we really tried yeah. our best to be as racist we as we bad. possibly could today. So um, yeah. we can. I was just gonna say. Well, I mean, we should. I don't know because it cuts off. But yeah, um, I'll message Christine tomorrow, and and we'll try to figure out a time by Monday. So that way, yeah. it's earlier for her, and yeah, yeah it be it works work out. Definitely, mm -hmm. we can. Yeah, we can, we can mess with the time definitely. It's not the white podcast, podcast, not the black podcast. We ain't catching no spirit. We look, certain times, we were 10 to 11, 10 to 11. Bro, mm -hmm. I have a lot of things I'm doing nowadays. I'm planning, getting ready. I'll go back yeah. to doing I mean, we don't have to do it every day. I'm saying do it. it yeah, I can't do this every day. No, mm -hmm. no, 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 mm -mm. They don't pay you that much. Pay, uh, Patreon no. does not pay you that much, no. No, is, and not even that. It's Matrix. I don't no. like mm -hmm. being in their world. <laughs> Well, Facebook, they're building my social, AI soul sucker right now. I know it. So, social media is like a a playground, <laughs> but it's too many damn teachers on the playground. Like yeah, at first, it was fun. Like the beginning, you know, remember, you remember the beginning of recess? As soon as recess started, everybody ran out on the field, yeah, running in circles because you hate school, jumping, flipping, doing stuff, rolling in the grass, all the stuff your mother told you not to do because you got on your new jeans and shoes and stuff. 
and then the teachers come out because they walk slower. And then once all the teachers get positioned one by the monkey bar, all the prison inmate guards, that's what they really were. And they come out one by the soccer field, one by the football field, one by the bed. And this is what social media is like now. You can't have no fun because everybody's reporting each other and yeah. Zuckerberg and the, and the learning <laughs> software. You know what, Christine, when I was done, when you went to Facebook prison, if y'all can put yeah. Christine wins in Facebook prison, there's something the hell wrong with y'all. Y'all got some dark energy <laughs> creatures, spiritual icons, uses evil. <laughs> Christine wins don't say nothing about nobody. She's the most lovingest person I know on this damn planet. She's just all so kind and sweet. And if they can put you in Facebook prison, they are definitely dark forces. This, but not reptilian. You can't say he's reptilian no more. Um, all right. They fact checked it. It was true. They were in trouble. <laughs> no, not going there. I'm going to leave that alone. It, it, yeah, listen. it wasn't true. He just doesn't read the Bible. That's why it was fact checked. He's, He's such a nice there. and sweet young man. He, yep. he, he loves he children. Loves you, and he loves <laughs> grandmama and children. And he does not like war. And he peace, love, fair, grease, and happiness. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to talk about our Lord and Savior, Master of the Universe, that we're resonating in at this moment in time. I'm done. Like I'm, not Harris. <laughs> I'm not fighting that neither. She's, she's a lovely, wonderful church. woman. She go to church every Sunday. She did not fight to keep people in prison. She loves grandmama nope. too. I'm just I'm leaving it alone. I'm done. Sometimes you got to let people stew in it. Stop trying, like you keep pulling people out the stew like it's hot. Don't get in there, dummy. It's, yeah, it's hot. Get in there, dummy. And they just keep jumping in the soup. Just, All right, fine. Go on. The carrots and the onions. I'm having like a Bugs Bunny episode. I remember Bugs Bunny? Mm -hmm. when they used to take bugs and put them in the stew with the carrots and stuff. Oh, that looks so delicious. They just yeah. just in the stew. And then he used to paint his face to be like, oh. Didn't they completely <laughs> ban? Looney Tunes now. Yeah, they did. They completely banned it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, well, Elmer Fudd, he can't have a gun. They took his gun. They Elmer Fudd can't have a gun. Mm -hmm. Didn't they give him something stupid like a hatchet or something? It's like, oh, this is safe. Yeah. Is yeah. Wait, guess <laughs> what? <laughs> Chopping up a rabbit and a duck with a hatchet isn't violent at all. But, but now on Disney, on Disney, right? You have to, um, there's like automatic parental restrictions on Peter Pan, Dumbo, and the Aristocrats. Mm -hmm. And and as Dr. Seuss, what is it with Dr. Seuss? Why, the, why can't Dr. Seuss be on Facebook? I don't know. One of the books are supposedly bad, but then that meme got fact-checked because they were like, no, the cat in the hat is okay. So yeah. I don't know which book it is. You know what? But it's one of them. Let these people cook in the stew. Yeah, I'm just I'm you know, I'm done. I mean, everybody who actually wants to do right are focused on doing what's right. Everybody right. else want to see what's going to happen when the temperature gets too high. Let them see. It. Just let them see. it. That's where we are, because mm -hmm. I think after a while, when you keep trying to pull people away from darkness, they keep pulling towards it. Yeah, you just have to let them go because if you keep pulling, yeah. them, they're just going to keep trying to pull. Back. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's a principle in that, isn't there? Yeah. And yeah. you will end up with them in the darkness. So yeah, yeah. no, that's yeah. that's All having right. discretion. One time you have to stop. Yeah, yeah. But a pendulum does what it does. You gotta let that pendulum swing all the way. Yep. Let people really learn that lesson. And unfortunately, we're gonna lose some people. We always lose some people, mm -hmm. and let it swing back. You, know, yep. you gotta let people learn their lessons. And yeah, you know. So this is where I grew with both on. You know. I don't even know what else because he's crazy as hell. Look like a serial killer. Um, <laughs> I never go for a hike with that man. No damn Arizona mountain. I, I don't know what's wrong with you, Jonathan. I have no <laughs> no, he look, come on, stop it. Let's be honest. Stop it. Yes, he does. He looked like a 1980s leather book serial killer. Somebody in a cabin somewhere. Your car broke down in the middle of the woods. And you with the pretty lady, she's like, oh, let's go see who's in the cabin. Let's knock on the door. No, we're not doing <laughs> Oh my not God. Doing white horror movie. We're doing black horror movie. No, we're not going anywhere near yeah. that door. We're going to get on the street and you run. Know, you know, there's <laughs> things he does where he's got like the redneck hair and the overalls. I know he doesn't help it. I Texas know. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Right. I don't know. <laughs> I know. Think about this. And Jonathan went in the hills with him. <laughs> 
I was joking with, I was like, yeah, both, did he have a shovel? Both of did he take a shovel? Both of us making jokes like, yeah, you, you don't go on no hills without no shovel. You don't never know what you need to do. <laughs> and and John's doing another one. <laughs> I get in the hills. I'm John's just like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> John has no fear. That that man is brave. That man, I tell you, shoot. No, I'm not gonna tell you that story. That's the that's border stories of X Files. I can't tell you what he did at the, at the border, but yeah, that man, he has no fear at all. He is the professor. Maybe if you can teach children in, in college, <laughs> you can deal with anything. It's like New York. If you can make it there, walking with the hills in both lines. Kind of nonsense. Business. I deal with teenagers and philosophy, please. <laughs> okay. right. We're wrapping up. So we learned a lot tonight. Wasn't that good? Mm-hmm. We like we didn't get banned. First time I did a video with y'all in two weeks, and y'all didn't get me in Facebook prison. Thank you, Elaine Scarpo, for that- not saying things to get us in trouble. Elaine did it last time. Y'all know that, right? Hey, that Elaine. was her. Was it Buddhist? Yeah, was yeah, Buddha it's, Buddha it's always Buddha's fault. It's Buddha's fault. She, she, didn't got, she, she didn't got us locked up. She mentioned that man's name that you're not supposed oh, to say. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> For real? It's good, though. That wrong with said it all night. Yeah. Yeah, um, you know what? It's not I thought fault. it was the B word. No, no, no. no I, I think it was that because I noticed that the times that I get in trouble, it has to do when I did what I just did, which is I don't claim identities. And it's when you mentioned what happened in World War II, just before World War II. When you mention those people, when oh. you quote them, when you oh, mention yeah. whatever's tracking me, and, and people. Software, yeah, they have, it's flagging me when those names are used. So I just mm-hmm. told everybody who wants to get me kicked off of Facebook how you get me kicked off of Facebook. And I actually don't care. Because yeah. mm-hmm. In complete disagreement with the brother name start with an M who says I'm here for Gucci. Uh, what? Well, I, I, no, I'm sorry, Wucci. <laughs> he said I'm here for Wucci. Um, I have. I boggles my mind what people think. He's psychoanalyzed. What are we talking about now? I'm completely lost. Yeah, I'm really lost now. Yeah, all right. Gucci or Wucci? See, uh, basically, no it all goes back Isn't to Wucci. Well, I've been <laughs> hanging around Coco too much. See? Yeah. yeah. She could get you in trouble. <laughs> yeah, it ain't just Elaine. No. Elaine, no. It ain't just, see, it, 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 Cuckoo, she get you in big trouble, too. She, she another one. She ain't got no limits. That woman tell you exactly what she think, when she think it, how she think it, how long she thought it, till you get in trouble with her. And she, as she should. <laughs> she should. As she should. As she should. I tell women what they should do. I, I tell men Coco. what they should do all the time. I don't tell women what they do nothing. Again, mm-hmm. y'all ain't got no limits. <laughs> there you go, Jonathan. Stay out of trouble. All right, what did we learn tonight so we can get off of here? Somebody wrap it, it up. It's, it'll be on the quiz. What did we learn? <laughs> <laughs> it's a professor cop. It'll be on the quiz. <laughs> it'll, be on, <laughs> it'll be on the quiz. I don't know. It's okay. Um, so we didn't learn nothing tonight. We read no, about not really. We read about a page out of the Yeah, I did. I know. I find we did difficult. Talk a little bit about sacred geometry <laughs> and, and a little bit about numerology. That's very difficult. Yeah, the, it's yeah. very difficult. It's very, uh, I'm not a math person. I'm not a math person. Me neither. I stand things in. I understand things. It gets but, me, and then I understand, but there is no logic in my mind. So the, thing, the thing that the thing that I have trouble with. And maybe, and maybe you're the same is, is being able to, uh, you know, we see, you know, and Susan, you and I have talked about this too, about the four, three, two, you know, is we see the connections between the numbers, but to actually like, you know, and then there's the Fibonacci sequence, which is reflected in nature is being able to take those connections, those numerological connections, and then tie them into the spiritual life apply, that's where, them. That's, apply mm-hmm. them to the spiritual life mm-hmm. that's where i'm like how does this where's the connect where, where's the connector here you know uh in, in all of this stuff and i yeah. i really think we um to, to use a dr seuss reference we like horton have to just sit on that egg until it hatches we do mm-hmm. because 
realizations happen in their own time, hmm. not in the time that we think or we think they should happen in. <coughs> That's yeah. a hard thing to accept. In the words of Ty Jenkins, Jackson, Vaden, whatever his last name is now. Good luck changing the world. Go on, change it. Get out there and change your world. You can't change the world. The world will go the way it's supposed to, when it's supposed to. All you can change is yourself and the environment around you. You know, just focus on that. You know, so I'm done with the fight. I'm just yeah. observed from now on. All right. Well, Speaking we'll of here. observe, I talked to Debbie the other day. Debbie Lusignan, she's doing fantastic. Oh, that's nice. That's good. That's great. That's she would. She actually wrote the um, the petition that Claudia sent out, and mm. they ripped off of the site. <laughs> it's been two days that it went up because it actually was factual. So you, know, you can't let medical professionals read factual things because over half. All right, now I'm getting in trouble. Hey, listen. Ooh, that was fun. <laughs> All right, the playground is over. The play date is over. The recess is uh, ended. <laughs> we're going to get told on. So we back start again. To wrap up. All right. Okay. So who got the last okay. comment? People will make, will, Leave it people up to will the wake up when they're good and ready, not when, not we, when we want them want. to. Yeah, that's the yes, way. exactly. Yeah. That's exactly. the end of the story. Mm -hmm. I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe. That's all, folks. Is that a good way to end? Yeah, yeah. If we if we impede on someone else's sovereignty and free will, yeah. we will have ours impeded on. Mm -hmm. it's very true. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Okay. okay. Well, everybody, have good a night. wonderful night. Tell grandma have a wonderful night. Tuck the kids in, drink your smoothies, and stop being mm -hmm. stupid. Something like that. <laughs> oh, come on, bye. Mm -hmm. Break the chains that bind me Cause I wanna break the chains that bind you Do you wanna set the world free? Have perfect harmony Isn't it time for that? Do you wanna free, free? Mm -hmm. Free the people, do you wanna free, free? Boom, boom people from the bottom to the top make modern slavery stop do you want to let go of the prisoners see everyone happy we can have this and more if we open up the door well what do you think about do you want to free, 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 boom, boom, free the people? Do you want to free, free, boom, boom, free the people and Mother Nature too? Close down all the zoos. Do you want to boom, 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 boom? Do you want to boom? Do you want to free, 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 boom, boom, free the people? Do you want to free?